Well, you guys, I am super excited today because this video is long overdue and I'm so excited to do this what's in my bag video. For those of you new here, I am Marcy Sauter, the Rusty Blonde. Welcome back to my channel. This bag is a beauty. I absolutely love her. She is a DH Gate designer dupe. Beautiful. I absolutely love using her. And she fits so much stuff inside. We're going to go through it all and I'm going to show you everything I'm able to carry. So starting with the front, I found this adorable Louis Vuitton bag scarf from DH Gate as well. You can see so pretty, matches perfect, easy to tie, and I just love it. I love bows in general, but oh my God, it's pink and it matches and it's just my personality. So that is so cute adding to your bag. Next, I have my bag hook. This thing is awesome. If you go into a restroom and don't have a place, don't have a hook, you now have your own personal hook so that you don't have to put your beautiful bag on the floor. Okay, moving on to the inside, I have a ton of stuff. I'm gonna start with what I have clipped and just kind of move around. So you're gonna see a lot of items that I did not have before. A lot of these I got from Christmas. So it's very exciting. And the first thing I have to show you is my husband got me AirPod Pros. I used to have the, just the regular AirPods and I tell you what, these are amazing. And I got this adorable little case, pink sparkly to match, so fun. So that I just clip right here on the clip inside so that I know where they're at at all times. Moving forward, I have this beautiful bag organizer inside. Again, I love these organizers. It keeps everything nice and tidy and snug. Nothing gets lost in a big, big dark hole and they're glorious if you have not tried them. They are from Amazon. I am going to try and link what I can down below so that you guys have access to it if there's something you see that you like. So starting in this back pocket here of the organizer, I don't keep anything in the zipper pocket. I usually just throw my change in it from when I'm shopping. But I keep my adorable little notepad. This is like my favorite notepad. I use it very sparingly and it's super cute. I got this from a little private shop and I will link her website down below. So next item we have is my favorite planner wallet. This is an authentic Louis Vuitton wallet. For those of you who follow me know that I have a ton of videos on how I decorate this and how I use it to plan and organize my cash and all of that. Super cute. I have a whole Valentine's Day theme. I will link that up above for you guys if you're interested in checking this baby out. But I absolutely Love this system and it's kept me on my cash budget and I can't say enough good things about this wallet. Okay, moving on to the best part, other than the purse itself, is my new whatnot bag. This guy is from Truffle. It's real leather with the clear, front and bottom. I freaking 
love this. I got this along with some other pouches for Christmas between my husband and my mom and they're amazing. I use them for travel, I use them in my purses, and the, the quality, uh, uh, all of it. The zipper is super smooth, just glides all the way around. The leather is so pretty, and they have different color options, and obviously, <laughs> it's pink. But let's go ahead and show you everything I keep inside my whatnot bag. So, the first thing is my Tums. These are just a Tylenol bottle that fit Tums perfectly. I just taped a, the name on it and that's that. Next, I have my very mini. This is 0.2 fluid ounces of Melaleuca oil that I always carry with me. Or I shouldn't say always, I just have been since Christmas. You know, since I got my new bags, I had to redo my whatnot bags. And basically this one is awesome. I can transfer it from bag to bag. It's large, but it's compact if that makes any sense at all. But it fits well in all of the other bags I use. So then I have my, um, these are my rosy lips by Vaseline. Just a super nice, gloss for your lips and it's hydrating as well so i really enjoy having those my dental floss because if you all know i don't go anywhere without dental floss my husband's a dental floss freak and so am i now then i have my adorable tape measure i have been using this guy a ton um if you haven't seen it i've been doing a ton of organizational videos um that's just what I was in the mood to do in January, and I've reorganized so many spaces within my home. Some of the videos I have uploaded, some of them are still in the process, but I think by the end of February, they will all be up and loaded. Then I have my classic uh, medicated chapstick. That is for chapped lips. I have my Melagel, which this is amazing. It's got Melaleuca oil in it, and it's in the form of a cream. Then I have my tiny, tiny to-go bottle of potpourri. You all know how I feel about potpourri and having to go potty in public toilets, but this one's awesome. It's small. I also have another size um, that's small as well, but this one I found in the tube form and it's pretty awesome for my whatnot bag. Then I have my itty bitty perfume. This is my favorite perfume. I've been wearing it for years thanks to my sister and um, I found it in an itty bitty travel bottle and now I can keep this in my purse. I have my travel scissors, which I can't even count how many times I've had to use them. They're sharp, they're awesome, they're amazing. They're even allowed on an airplane, which I did take them with me to Colorado after Christmas when we went. Then I have my mini Altoids case. I also have my dental picks, which these are just awesome. If you don't have time to floss, you can just grab a pick. Then I have my cinnamon Listerine strips. And this is a new item. This is a tiny pill box. I love this. They're handmade. It was found on Etsy and this was also a Christmas gift. But inside I keep my two daily medications. It's a three compartment storage. Um, and then I have my allergy medicine in case I need it on the go or forget to take my medicine and recognize it later. I have a set with me so that I'm always prepared. Then I have my travel tampon, which is a must. I have my travel eyeliner, which is by MAC. It's engraved and black. And then my Lancome mascara. Those are just backups. One came in a travel bag um, with many items. And then this one here, I just use my regular purchased eyeliner until it's small and then it gets transferred to my purse bag. Then I have this awesome kit. I've had this 
for a while now, but it's made by Tweezer Man and it holds, it's a little nail kit for on the go. It has your nail file, tweezers, your cuticle or nail picker here, and then your clippers. In case you get a hang nail or break a nail on the go, you are covered. And I have used this quite often. Then I have my little eyeglass um, screw driver in here, which I haven't had to use this, but I have had to use this in the past, um, a couple years ago. So now it just goes with me because that's super handy to have when you're in a pinch and need something for your glasses. Then I have my to-go toothbrush. These are awesome. There's a little gel pocket of fluid in there that pops and gives you that burst of freshness to freshen up your breath. I have bobby pins. I have three safety pins, a hair tie, and rubber bands. Then I have my pre-spot, which is also by Melaleuca. If I spill something, coffee, whatever, I just rub it on my shirt, leave it there, and then it goes through the wash and it takes care of the stain. Then I have four of my little alcohol pads. I no longer use these on my eyeglasses. Um, and I'll show you why in just a little bit, but the alcohol in them, I think it was the alcohol. But anyways, it was kind of taking the finish off of my eyeglass frames, and I recently got these new glasses and I don't want that to happen to these. So these I just basically use for my electronics, my phone, the radio in the car, small cords, things like that. Then I have my Gold Bond Healing Lotion. This is my favorite lotion. It's really nice. It's a subtle fragrance. There's aloe in it and it's really thick and creamy. So that's part of why I love it. You can get these in multiple sizes. I buy them in the family size. And then this is the smallest tube I've found. And then they have a larger, I think two ounce tube as well, which I also have that one. Next, I have my to-go straw. This is stainless steel and inside it has a, where is it? There it is, <laughs> I pulled it out the wrong way, but it has a tube to actually clean it and it's just a telescopic straw and that's awesome if I ever need one on the go or if I choose not to use a plastic one, I have my own. Then this, this I also got for Christmas. This is awesome, you guys. This is called a Diamond Dazzle Stick. I will link it down below. You literally, let me show you this. It's got like brush, it's a brush if you can see that. But basically, you twist this up, a solution goes in there, and you can clean your diamond and it makes it flawless. It is so beautiful. As you know, I wear quite a bit of jewelry and this guy has been awesome. So cool. I love it. If I get lotion in there or soap scum, whatever. And last but not least in my whatnot bag, I have all of my band-aids in different sizes. So all of that fit in this bag and this is what it looks like empty. Cute, simple, but oh my gosh, you guys, it holds a lot of stuff. It's like I said, it's my new favorite bag. And it fits well in like all of my other purses, which is so nice. And the stuff I can just toss in here, shake it up and it all just falls nicely in there and zips close. It's amazing. Let me show you, I put this in here, no rhyme or reason, okay? No rhyme or reason, and it just zips. And that's how I keep it in my purse. Freaking awesome. Okay, so next is I have my hand sanitizing wipes, my sunglasses case, which I wear prescription sunglasses. I have two pairs that I rotate through. This is what it's looking like so far in this center zipper compartment. I keep two face masks 
And then, okay, here's another one of these pouches. This is the smallest one they sell, but I freaking love it. It's made by Truffle, same brand, same pink leather. I use my, re, my, uh, oh my gosh, I can't even think of the name. My charger there, my battery charger. So anyways, this is from Tiffany's. I think I got it when I had my jewelry cleaned or something like that. But basically I just keep a spare set of headphones in there in case mine die while I'm on the go. So that's been great to just hold this little stuff in here. Then it doesn't fall to the bottom of my purse. I know exactly where my battery is and things like that. So this, these little bags have been awesome. I got this in the three sizes. This is the smallest. There's a slightly larger one and then a, an even larger one. And these are awesome quality, you guys. Awesome. Um, I am in a book club with my mom and sisters and a couple friends. And we are reading Ready Player One. I am on chapter 13 now. It's a really good book if you haven't read it. I have not seen the movie, but I know there's a movie out as well, but I am really enjoying this book for the month of February. So those two items, then I have my big red gum, my little to-go um, tissues. I keep my pink pen in here, and then um, some hand sanitizer, and then my adorable Louis Vuitton key fob. It just holds all my keys. I've been using this for a while now and I absolutely love it. Yes, and it's another thing that just fits in all of my bags. So great. So you guys, I think that's it. The only other thing I have clipped in here is, okay, back to the wipes and why I no longer use them. They were eating the finish off of my glasses. But this guy here, this is from Norwex. It's a hanky on a nice little clip. You guys, I got this for Christmas and it is the best eyeglass cleaner I have ever used in my life. Most of the time, see, I originally switched, switched to the wipes because I use the cleaning cloths that come with the glasses and they're dirty and end up just smearing my lenses. This guy, I have been using this since Christmas, so over a month now, and I have not had to clean it. It still gets my glasses squeaky clean. It's amazing. I don't know how it does not get dirty, but it doesn't. So I seriously, this is just a bag transfer. I move it and clip it inside any bag that I'm using because I'm constantly cleaning my glasses. So that is an amazing find. And you guys, I think that's it. So now I'm gonna pull my stuff out and show you the actual organizer and inside of the bag. So this is the organizer. I have this in red, I have it in multiple sizes, and it's awesome. Two pockets here, a pocket here, a center pocket, three there, three here, two on the outside, and then this large one on the outside. What is that? Oh, my notebook. Yeah, it's just amazing. The center compartment comes out if you don't want it, but I love it because it keeps everything nice and tidy. Oh yeah, and the other thing I have is my garage door opener. I just keep this clipped in here as well. So the inside of this bag is so beautiful, you guys. It's light pink, so pretty with faint line details on it. And I just really, really love this bag. I enjoy it. I get quite a few compliments on it. And same with the bow. The bow just adds that much more to the bag. And seriously, it's a great bag, one of my favorites. So there you have it. My designer dupe, Louis Vuitton from DH Gate, and this is the Neverfull MM size. So the middle size, not the small, not the large, the middle size. So you guys, it was so fun doing a what's in my bag video. I know it's been forever since I've done one, 
but I thought this would be fun because of all of the new items I received for Christmas as gifts. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I have lots more videos planned for the future. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. It really helps me out. Share my channel with your friends and family. So anyways, you guys, happy Valentine's Day. I hope you have an amazing weekend and we'll see you on my next video. Bye.